All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode of Stranded Deep on the channel. We are on episode 15 of season two. My name is Jace, our quote unquote raft um, is a quote unquote, what was I going with last time? Dreadnought, it's a dreadnought. Oh, actually, hang on, we've got audio over here. We don't want that. Go away, go away. All right. Sorry guys. Okay, I was talking to myself. It was disturbing. So, what we're going to do today... Uh, I actually can't remember what we, we're going to do today. We've, we've got some fuel. We've planted that um, cura plant. The cura plant is kind of useless. Like, I mean, we can have a fruit off it every so often, but... Oh! It's a potato! It's a real potato! Oh, fantastic! Can we water this one then? I think everything worked out. I think because maybe just because we reloaded, it fixed the potato. Uh, is there no water in this? <gasps> Save the potato! Oh no! Sadness. Um, can you water them with coconuts? I don't think so. All right, let's uh, see if we can save the potato. That's that's uh, route number one for today. Palms are over here. Well, of course, of course, I'm full of stuff. Um, we have some leather and we have some planks. We don't have space for that leather. And the planks were somewhere weird. Yeah. Oh yeah, we were going to use those four planks to make uh, the foundation over there so we could make the water still over there. That was the plan. Okay, okay. I know that was super pro, but... There's there's the plan. Okay, uh, uh no, I actually grabbed the palm this time. Still don't have icons. I don't know if it's because they intend to take them out or what the deal is. So let's load this thingy. Let's load this up and then hopefully get one watering into the potato before it dies. Okay, good, good, good. Where did that axe go? Okay, save the potato. We saved the potatoes, guys. The potatoes have survived. So this guy, I almost don't want to waste my time on. Like, I kind of might just rip it out right now and plant this other potato we have. We need a bit more water first, though. So, let's work on that. Get this one definitely alive, and then uh, then we'll plant the second one. Okay, well, that's... I know that seems like nothing, probably, if you're just tuning in, but... Oh, I'm excited. Basically, potatoes can be used to ferment into, like, biofuel. Uh, and we have a little device up here to do exactly that, a fuel still. Um, and we have a jerry can, which I believe is about 75% full, if not basically a full engine of gas. Oh, that needs to be retagged as meat, for sure. And this was all the stuff ready to be made into a water still that I want to put here, but I haven't put the foundation yet. And then we find a couple of planks and we can now do that, theoretically. Da, 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 da. No, I know this is going to be a kind of boring start to the episode, but a potato's life is at stake. Do not be racist about that. Please. Thank you. BRB once, uh, once we have some water. I might be an idiot. Just, just FYI. Um, so we need to go over here and grab us some deep. What do we need? We need four haunches, which I believe the big one will do, but I want to see exactly how much a big one gives us. So I kind of want to wait till we're below four haunches to use one. So that gave us three full. Um, so I guess we're going to put this foundation in while we wait for the water. Drop these. Don't need this guy. Potato can go down where it's gonna go. Well, that'll do. Do 
pizza. Um, so yeah, grab the planks. And do we have a hammer on us? No, we'll grab the hammer wherever it is. <laughs> we got our second lantern, so uh situation has improved marginally. Seriously? Am I gonna have to go get a hammer? That sucks. Wow, one of these is pretty battered up. 29%. Okay, so yeah, foundation here. So we don't need this to build the water stone. I'm going to set it here, although that's in the sun right now. It probably won't be in two seconds. Palm frond. The rocks. The coconut flask. The lashing. And the cloth. Um, drop this for a sec. Drop this for a sec. enough for the water still? Yes it is. Uh, well I'll not let you put it on a foundation. That kind of sucks if that's the case. I mean it's reasonable. I think it's, I still don't understand the technology. I'm wondering if they're absorbing it somehow from the, from underneath. From the underneath. You want it just there? Oh, that plant is growing fast. I think I'll try and tuck it in here. Some way that looks reasonably level. Definitely not that way. Oh, this game. I'm not sure if we put it there, if we're able to put the foundation in. I really don't want to put it far away though, that'd be really annoying. Far away. I mean, it seems kind of like a purposeless endeavor. I don't know. We can't get it to look, you know, half a reasonable, I kind of don't want to even bother. But I mean, another water still is useful for sure. What if I put it here? Can you reach it over the, uh, over the wall? This might work. <laughs> yeah, let's try and do this. Secret water. Secret water. Okay. And then we can grab whoop, the other palms to throw into it. Still not sure how we made the infinite one last time by accident. Be fair, there should be one beside the gardening stuff as well. Do you have a fruit yet? A fui? Nay fui. Alright, let's grab the water. We should have enough now.
Okay, potato one successfully salvaged. Once we have uh, once we have more water, we will do the we'll rip this out and plant. We'll probably take the fruit off, I guess, so we have one. Um because we can afford to wait now that we need to wait on the water anyway. Um yeah, so I guess we want we need more planks, that's obvious. We need to label this thing meat, because it's gonna annoy me if I don't. So I'll get this stocked up again. Alright, so we were hoping at the end of the last episode to be able to get out and uh, visit another island, which we have evidently not done yet, but we had the, the potato fiasco, which is now being resolved, which is great. It means we can, um, we're now sustainable for gas, it's just going to take a minute. Uh, what have I got on me? Corrugated? Where'd that end up? It used to be down at the back. There it is. Enough now. Let's grab the crude hoe. Double check. No curve fruit yet. Okay. Potato. Water that bad boy. Okay. Perfect. So I think the potatoes are sorted. I feel a lot better about them. So this is a nice empty container. This is a basically full jerry can. I was thinking about putting these sort of um, crap walls up for the meantime because it kind of doesn't affect us resource-wise. So like we won't lose too much from ripping them down afterwards, but it's kind of not really worth it. So. <coughs> Let's save, we'll get prepared, and we will probably leave in the morning. So let's go grab a bunch of random fibrous leaves and stuff in the interim. Yuckers respawned. We kind of may as well just do that, although these are so 
You're so tempting. stick. Oh yeah, and there potentially would be bonus potatoes. I think they're running around this area. Yeah, those are the potato plants. Oh no, <laughs> it's in the coconut pit. Okay, <clears throat> so the potato situation seems to have uh, been resolved. I'm very pleased about this. So these two probably aren't enough, and we probably need to like just use this relatively flat space and remake them over here because they're totally disgusting as they are. Um, but there's not a super 
load of stuff for us to be doing on this island um, without more planks. So we should probably take a venture outward. Let's just grab this stuff because greedy. Okay. No bonus potat. No sign of a bonus potat on oh, a sneaky palm sapling. So would we had a look around this island for clay yet? Oh, we we're gonna kill the other shark. That's what we're gonna do. Let's go kill the other shark. So, to kill a shark we need some spears. We don't need a hammer. We don't need our farm and hoe. Uh, we won't need the fibrous. We will take the pickaxe in case we find some clay. And we drop this by the fire. Oh, did those things cook? Oh, I forgot all about these. Oh, so those smoked. They're all fine. Ah, uh, they're spoiled. What can you do with spoiled meat? Yeah, it won't let me uh, ferment it. I guess I'll throw it into the sea. I mean sense, doesn't it? Did I put one on this? No. I thought there were three of these total, though. Did I eat one of them? Maybe I ate one of them off the fire. I don't want to have spoiled snake meat lying in my bonfire forever. Okay, I think it's alright. Let's go drop these. We'll drop them while we're out. So, we need to grab more spears eat some stuff that isn't spoiled and actually use some of the water for herself well it is almost exactly now I got too dark to do this, but let's have a quick look. Oh, this is empty and everything. Okay. Alright, I think we're going to just uh, recover our stats and uh, sleep the night, and then we'll go in the morning. Is there a tank? What's it got left in it? 33. Oh, you can sort of see. Hmm. I don't. I think it's just demonstrating that it's uh, been used as opposed to it's like 33% used. Alright. Um, eat the thing. Uh, drop these off and then sleep. a little door for this one. It's actually p placed pretty poorly, but uh, we can fix it later. I think we're going to do another frondage before we go to sleep so they're full, theoretically, when we uh, wake up. Just don't want to go and uh, fight the shark and have you know no water, etc. Because our recovery will be greatly impaired. Oops. Really want planks though. Not sure why I even considered the fact that one palm would be enough. That was foolish. Okay, let's 
to do. So this is the music we're really not a fan of. It's uh I don't know. It sounds like old nitty stuff. Um, yeah, we came over here to get a drink from this one. Okay, we're good to go. And if we had a small meat that hadn't rotted, we'd eat that. But we'll eat this and instead. Um, so yeah, as soon as it's daylight, we're going to go out and try and find another shark. All right, it's time. It's too murky. Nearly early hours. Right, it's still pretty dodgy visibility right now. Trying to <laughs> trying to lure them now. This is a sudden change of gears. We are officially shark hunting right now, just so you know. That wasn't one, was it? Oh. It all just glitched in a weird way and couldn't bite me or something, but I think I was just seeing things. Uh, where's the shore? <laughs> Here. We just dropped the grouper in case we have, uh, in case we have food problems in the future that we do. We are accumulating quite the chest. Gorilla chest, right? What was that? The, this the Simpsons thing with Burns has the gorilla chest? Why is that a weird, vague memory? And not like a pungent, stinking memory that I can't get rid of, like all wonderful Simpsons stuff? Uh, blah, blah, blah. We can drop the spoiled rotten meat, and that'll uh, that'll entice him. Come on, take this nasty meat, and also the spoiled snake meat I brought you. Day twenty-five, <coughs> trying to shut us up. So I know we always find the other ship, but do we always find this one as well? Is it because there are two of them? Is that why we always find them? And they look identical and I just get confused? Seems feasible, doesn't it? It's sort of in these, like floating on the surface, as you might imagine, <coughs> open water situations that you tend to get attacked. I think generally when I'm moving quite a lot, I don't seem to get too much shark attention, unless you sort of run straight into them.
So, I'm pretty sure there was one over here. I <coughs> can't remember if we killed him or not, but there's definitely a dude hanging out here. wonderfully well lit for being this deep. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we've been in this one. But it's a prime territory for a shark to hang out, so where the hell are they? Whoa, okay. Okay. Got what I asked for. So I'm using the cover of the boat so he kind of can't come over, I think. Oh, I think. I think. Didn't work. Stab him. Oh, he got us again. He got me good. I knew he would. But he missed our heart. It's fine. Whew. Well, I'm pretty sure we're bleeding. Pretty sure. Can't check while we're holding the shark, unfortunately. It's hard to check your watch when you're dragging the tiger shark to shore. Alright, let's drag him over to wherever we are. I'm not sure. Try not to wreck the coconut pit. That would be sad. Okay, shark. Hey, 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 come on now. Let me just pull these out. There we go. So this is a tiger shark. Let's get the fire going. Um, we'll need sticks to do that. Should probably grab one of the stick boxes. Well, that was a jip. though. Thank you. Um, drop that. Oh, it's disgusting. So while we do this, I think we're just going to throw all these guys, all this meat on the fire and um, Head back out to where we were when we find the tiger shark and complete the complete the circle just to be sure. Feels like it's getting dark. One o'clock. Our health's reasonable given the uh, shark attack and bleeding and stuff. Uh, 
Okay, where do we put Thon Grouper? Groupie. I think I probably just dragged him to the to the shore, not over here, right? Oh no, there he is. sort of dealt with. Where did I put the uh, lather that was here? Um, <laughs> I can't believe I just checked that box. It's like I literally just checked that box. I was in it two seconds ago and I was like, oh, maybe it's in there. It's not. So we need a second leather daddy box. Okay, that's just wasn't uh, searched that one, so that's perfect. Um, I think our rations box is actually full already. Um, tools, 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 tools. <laughs> and it's just a hammers box now. Ask me a box of hammers, mate. Don't be going near that. A full box, I like a full box of hammers. Um, the rations are there, and they are indeed full, so that's fine. So, hang on, I just took that stupid junk box right and put it on here over here. Yep. Uh, cool. And we can put this hammer and tools to keep all our infinite hammers together. Okay, so I guess we go around this way. This is good, uh, good shark hunting weather. Occurs to me we probably should have saved after the first one, <laughs> but um, I, I think we can take a hit. I mean, this game's weird with it. Sometimes they uh, they literally nip you and barely touch you at all, and other times they tear you open with one swing. So I've never seen a white shark. I know they're in the game though. It's a reef shark. I don't think we need any more food. It's pointless killing them. So hang on, I should be going right really, shouldn't I? Well I find I think I found that shark by that boat, right? Sense direction terrible. Got no idea, really. I think that's why I'm uh, stalling somewhat on going to the next island. Because pretty sure we'll never find our way back. Really bad at it. <laughs> Alright, that's enough um, exploration. Let's go to the navigation box. Grab ourselves a compass and some binoculars. Let's see what we can see.
So I think that is the one we came from because it has the big massive wreck beside it. Well, that one looks big. That looks pretty minor. That one looks kind of significant too. That one seems relatively minor, but very close by. So I think we've got our eye on this one. Nope. <laughs> uh, maybe it was that one. I think it was probably that one. Yeah. This guy right here. So we want to go due north, right? That should not be difficult, right? We go due north, and then we go due south to come home, right? Yeah, right? We cannot mess this up, surely. Surely you can't be serious. Right, so let's... Grab this. Could just go on the gyrocopter, but I guess we want to try out the boat and see how it goes. And I don't really want to put fuel in a gyrocopter that we may or may not leave here. Because if you break it down, you don't get the fuel back. So ceremonial first raft fueling goes to plan. Finishes off all our resources. Or finishes off all the, the gas in one go. So that's four potatoes worth. Four potatoes fills the engine. And do we have new potatoes yet? We definitely don't. Not even not even close. Oh yeah, the bleeding from the shark thing. Uh, now that we have the facilities, we should make a load of bandages, so let's do that. Also, I really want to rename a couple things, because why wouldn't you? This guy is going to be fibrous leaves again. So I'll find this one's raw leather. clay coconuts that we really should just dump spent air that we really should just dump as well because we have um we have a spear gun so there's kind of no reason to keep these there's no reason really to keep them anyway but so why are the old stones not together sadness I should probably go where the leather goes. Uh, duct tape's there, clay's there. We can go here. It's 
spent there. Could probably go somewhere less uh, prominent. Swap it for the scrap. It's an empty, this is junk. Also junk, also empty. Actual sticks, actual sticks. Boy balls, also boy balls. <laughs> that was definitely gonna be boys balls by accident. my uh, chest of boys balls <laughs> keep it nice to my chest of hammers okay and then we wanted to rename the meat with just a meat box I do love a, a wooden box full of meat that seems really lovely this is just gonna be like house for now Now we probably want to dename tag a bunch of stuff just to make it more pleasant, but we'll see what this next island's like before we start getting too comfortable. Uh, is it in gear then? Yeah, it is. And weapons. Put these away. Those are all basic tools. I really don't think we should have all the hammers in here. Okay. I think that's uh, a good way to operate. We've got in the first aid trunk. Yeah, so we've got one bandage. We only have one antidote. We need to get some PP plant. And we have uh, four large smoked meats, so we shouldn't have any trouble while sailing around food wise. So, did I have overflow fiber sleeves, or are these the only ones? How did I have exactly three stacks? That doesn't seem feasible. <laughs> he's doing that thing again where he knows he has stuff, and instead he's going to get the other stuff. Okay, forget it. So we need eight per bandage, basically, right? Okay, so that's three bandages. We're going to use one, so we want one more. Lashings. Uh, hang on. Oh, it's the loom, right? Sorry. So we can make cloth from the fiber sleeves here. And then we can use the cloth and the lashings to make bandages. So using only fiber sleeves, you can get all the way up to bandages, which is pretty amazing. Perfect. Okay, so we, other than needing a few antidotes, we're quite well kitted out. It's all smoked. Yeah, it's all smoked. Any room in the meat locker? One medium can fit. So I just take out the mediums and put these large ones in their place, I guess. Probably, well, we might want to bring the knife. 
Yeah, we need all our basic tools. <laughs> this is just going horribly. Uh, might fill this up and um, yeah, we'll fill this up and we'll do. Oh, okay, it's the shadow of bats. I thought it was the boar. up grab two palms I dropped my axe that's ah, in tools checking our live time okay so we're gonna stick these in we could probably destroy the other smoker now So yeah, we're going to make another cloth. Uh, we need to make some more manageable leather. 
we will need to grab a couple of sticks. Uh, the other piece of leather is in here. And then the sticks. Okay, bed. Now I, I very much doubt you can place this on your boat. Yep, didn't work. So this is going to go... Uh, I guess we don't need the name tag when we're out and about, but I like having it there. There we go. So it's in navigation. That's not a sensible place to put it. It should probably be in gear or the gas. Gas is probably good for it. Move that useless boy balls to a useless thing. And then this extra electrical we don't need. Why don't we we can actually store it? Nice. Oh, we we definitely don't need it, but we can store it. That those are the correct terms. Okay, so kind of set up here. How much do we have in the way of create space to bring stuff back? One. Two. Three. Like one of these is empty-ish. Not even. Okay, we've only got two thing or one thing in there. Okay, so cloth's empty, coconuts could be empty. Bottom palms is empty, isn't it? Oh, it isn't? Why didn't you guys tell me? I've been. Oh, what? Oh, right. I just got carried away. Okay, I thought we were a box ahead. Do we have another. I swear we have another uh, non-complete stack of boy balls in one of these. Yeah, there you go. So leather's empty, duct tape's empty. Any of these go with duct tape? That kind of goes with duct tape. Doesn't really, but makes more sense to me. Okay, yeah, I mean, it's not bad. And we can take... What's that? Nothing. Um, take the house box for now and we kind of want to obviously have a space to bring back other boxes okay this is full so if these need watered we can do so and top it up drop it there grab this frond grab like Three more fronds. Don't know why I said it like that. Can't undo it now. It's just, it's just a reality that we all have to live with. I mean, you kind of don't, but I definitely do, unfortunately. Um, was that all the stuff we got back? Okay, another lashing. I keep pronouncing things in this really enunciated English way as if you're not going to understand my mumble. Oh, it's because you're not going to understand my mumble. That's why. Uh, let's throw this on the boat. Let's put the stones away. Uh, more palms. That's what we needed. I think I'll just grab them all out and we'll just leave a stack beside each.
seems pretty good. Potat? Potat? Nay, Potat. Okay, so let's save, sleep, <coughs> then we're going to head out due north in the morning and not get lost. That's the plan. And I'll see you guys then. In the next episode. Oh, <coughs> that was disgraceful. Um, yeah, thanks very much for tuning in, guys. If you've been on the stream, thank you very much. If you're watching this on YouTube, thank you very much. Uh, if you could... If you want to support in any way, shape, or form, you could like, follow, subscribe, do all the things, because it's a great way to help the channel out for free. Otherwise, I've been Jace, this has been Stranded Deep, and I'm really glad to have vaguely entertained you for a hot minute. All the best. <laughs>